Frank on TV again. Okay, Chad, I said this is from Frank and Chad. They didn't have time to wrap it. But you're to put these on because we wear this with our dresses. Y'all Okay. What's going on, guys? Welcome to another episode of Postal Boy TV. And this is going to be a little special because... My wedding anniversary, our wedding anniversary. I was about to say your. Uh, our our wedding anniversary There's is no coming more up. Your, no more mine. Yeah. Whenever you're talking about discussing things like poop and pee. Yeah. Okay. We have to poop. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Uh, but anyway, guys, uh, coming back to today with a very special episode of. The show where I'm actually going to be, we're going to be teasing you guys with uh, what is going to end up being the full on video of our wedding day. Uh, the recap video, the great production from Brent Baxter Photography. Yeah, so we just wanted to share with y'all some of our favorite clips from the whole wedding uh, day process from the prep all the way down to the send off. So check it out. We got married on Friday, October 21st, 2016 in Dallas, Texas. We were all getting ready at La Meridian Hotel where our makeup artist was Tavia and our hairstylist was Muff and we'll leave their details in the description box below. The day started off pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. I woke up in the hotel uh, after my bachelor party uh, and then I got in the truck and I drove all the way back to Allen uh, from Dallas, got here, cut my hair, and then I drove immediately back to the venue. And I was the very first person there, and I think I went into panic mode because I didn't feel like anything was getting done. So I tried to do everything that wasn't being done, like setting out chairs, setting out tables, helping people set up centerpieces. I'm making this long. But her dad came in and said, Hey, dude, you need to go sit down somewhere. Today is the day that you ain't supposed to do nothing. So just check out the footage and see what was going on. Okay. I'm gonna have to pay y'all. Right? Why is this girl holding my hand? She like me. <laughs> Let me show you how you do it. See right here? Okay. Get it, Danny. Thank you. Okay, get another one. You just be waiting on it, okay? Okay. You know, people are uh, people are always trying to give like advice in mm -hmm. these types of videos. Did did mm -hmm. you see any like advice in the videos that you thought was like some actual good advice? Yeah, my favorite piece of advice, it wasn't even to me. It was for oh. you but i just thought it was hilarious um it was from Corey malcolm you get um best advice of the year award. i don't know why i just did this you, did. you get best advice of the year award you know that that's the book right? like, okay check out a, check out the clip <laughs> <laughs> okay first frank uh make sure that you don't need to bring it on the first night Wait at least a year, bro. I said it's second night. Oh, hope nobody heard that. Those clubs. Shout out to Uncle Nene and Aunt Kathy for the magnificent dinner that they prepared for us. Uh, they get the shout out of all shout outs. Yes. Uh, one, because they've been taking care of me since I moved out here and like partly half of my life. I'm like their third child. But and they I'm number four. <laughs> but they did actually take the time to actually prepare our food for us, deliver it, and then drive all the way back out to Plano to, to support their son at his football game. Mm -hmm. And And then they came back. And then they came back. So shout out to Uncle Nene and Kathy. Yes, thanks guys. Everybody knows that in every wedding the ring bear uh, the ring bearers uh, and the groomsmen are always the hardest to uh, hardest groups of people to like to get together because we're always scattered. Yes. Uh, I don't have to worry as so much about my groomsmen. Okay, yeah, I did, but 
my little <laughs> my little guys they they came to me and I helped them uh, get the get themselves together. You know, like uh, even though they were in a handful, yes, they were a handful. Christian, Katie, come here for a second. You got their both sides? They were in they were in next side. <laughs> wedding photographer was Marcel with Marcel HP Photography. Uh, Franklin has uh, known him since college. They went to Louisiana Tech together. That's my brother. Yeah, so he did our wedding photos. He is amazing. So if you're looking for a wedding photographer in the Dallas area, I'm going to leave his details in the description bar below. But um, yeah, if you're planning on getting married anytime soon, don't skim out when it comes to your photographer. Like, if you're going to cheat yourself anywhere, don't let it be with photography. Yeah. Like, don't get a good cake. You're not going to eat all that anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> so, I had nine amazing, amazing bridesmaids. Um, two of them were my sisters. Two were Franklin's sisters. Um... I had my cousin in there, three of my best friends, and my friend Sean is here. Oh, right. I'm like, I see you, I see you. Hey. 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 It was actually finally my time to actually take my photos. Uh, and it's kind of different being on the other side of the camera, so I enjoyed it while it was my time. I don't know how to explain it. Like it's like a very weird feeling. Feeling whenever a group of guys get together as brothers, even though uh, my older cousins are like my cousins, they are my brothers to me. So that was pretty much it when it comes to what we had to do to prepare for the wedding. Yeah. So uh, after the after they did photos, they came back in. We were like ten minutes late, and I'm in the back freaking out, but everything looked really nice on the inside. Right. They did a pretty good job. Um, I enjoyed it. The ambiance was very feng shui-ish for a wedding. Yeah. Everybody that comes to us and talks about the wedding, they always say, I never, I've been to lofty spaces before, but I've never seen it look like that. Mm -hmm. I was like. They did good. So while everybody else is scrounging around and like getting everything ready to look pretty, like our minds are on like, walking down the aisle like I was just so ready because I had waited for this day for a really long time <laughs> we are like about to embark on something that's like some something that's like it's a bound contract between you another person and your creator I was just excited to run down the aisle and make everything official seal this covenant between myself and Franklin our Heavenly Father. <laughs>